What is going on, everybody? Sports expert here, and we do have some breaking news in the NFL. We have a couple of trades. We've had a lot of cuts today and everything, and yeah, but we do have a couple of trades that you know I want to report and you know give my thoughts on. And yeah, so before we start the video, please hit the subscribe button for news to the channel, turn on the post notification bell, like the video, comment what you think about these trades. And if you guys do not know, memberships are out on this channel. So if you guys want to join the channel, if you if you'd like to join the channel, hey, I mean, open to it. Definitely not required, nothing at all. But, you know, we're going to have special perks there, and we're going to do everything we can. Have a great time over at the memberships. So, yeah, um, so there's three levels. But, yeah, let's get started to the uh, – once you click on the link in the description, they will show and might may put it in the pinned comment as well. So, yeah, but you – know, yeah, I'll probably put it in the pinned comment anyway, yeah, so – and the description. But the Houston Texans and Minnesota Vikings made a trade. Ross Blacklock – the former second round pick by the Houston Texans in 2020. He is going to the Minnesota Vikings. I couldn't remember for some reason because, you know, I'm talking about two trades at a time. Just weird. But yeah, he's going to the Vikings. And a seventh round pick is also going to the Vikings. And the Texans are receiving a sixth round pick in return. If you told me Ross Blacklock would have been traded for a sixth round pick two years ago, two years later... And I would have said you're crazy. I wasn't the biggest Blackhawk fan. I'll say that. I thought he was good, but I, did I think he was great? No. But, you know, I, I love this trade of the Vikings. Love it. I think there's still some upside with Blackhawk. They're one of the better teams in football at developing defensive linemen. Great home for Blackhawk. Just didn't work out in Houston. And a newer regime in Nick Casario, et cetera, had to, re, you know, cut ties with him as they just didn't feel too much confidence in him moving forward. But a team like the Vikings with Kowesi, who cut a ton of players today, almost their whole 2021 draft. Patrick Jones did stay on the team, though, if I'm correct. So he's one of the guys. Obviously, Darasaw did, but yeah, so Blackhawk, he is being traded. Really like the uh, addition of the Vikings. Don't know if he'll be in a, a pro board in the NFL, but I think he could definitely be like a very solid defensive tackle, like Dalvin Tomlinson, solid. But, you know, yeah, so... And our second trade, the Las Vegas Raiders and the Arizona Cardinals made a deal. Trayvon Mullen, the cornerback, former Clemson product, he is headed to the Arizona Cardinals. We do not know the terms of that deal yet, but a great trade, great trade. I got to say it twice because of how great of a trade it is for the Cardinals. I love Trayvon Mullen. Very talented player. If he can stay healthy, more so. Wow, they have an absolute steal. He'll be a starting quarterback, cornerback for the Cardinals for sure. I mean, he has all the potential in the world. I think he can be a future pro bowler, only 24 years old. I just, I mean, I get everyone wants to get rid of everybody. And, you know, Dave Ziegler is just trying to clear house him and Josh McDaniels. But I am i don't get getting rid of Mullen, man. I don't, I don't get that at all. But, you know, the Cardinals take advantage of, it, advantage of it. I think I said something that they gave up a seventh. If that's true, then what are you doing? You got to be kidding me. If they had to only give up a seventh for Trayvon Mullen, they are absolutely smoking the Raiders. Jesus. I hope I gotta look at it again. I'll look at it after the video. Yeah. You know, I might put it in the description, you know, the terms. But yeah. Something like that, seventh rounder. God, that'd be something. And the Raiders, they just waved Alex Weather Leatherwood, who they uh drafted last year in the Mayhawk era. And yeah, he just didn't work out too well for them. So they're just gonna cut ties now and yeah. So not ideal for Alex Leatherwood. Apparently they tried to get a trade offer from all 32 teams. They all said no. Not sure what the asking price was, but I'm assuming it was a high pick just due to his first round pick, uh, you know, selection last year. So yeah, but that's the NFL news that's going on right now. We're going to keep posting more videos as stuff goes on, but I appreciate everyone being here. Sports expert here. Please hit the subscribe button for you to the channel. Turn on the post notification bell. Like the video. Comment what you think. I'm out, guys. Sports expert here. Peace. Oh yeah, Kellen Mond got waved as well today.